Welcome back to Fast Freddy RC, and today I want to give you a tip on how to put the white lettering on your tires. I know I see this on a lot of cars. I like to do it because I think it makes the car look faster too. Um, it just gives the tire a little bit more style. So I want to be able to color that in um, on both sides, the, the smoothie and sand tires unlimited. And I want to show you how to do that because this is what I've found to be the easiest thing to do. This is an acrylic paint pen. Marks on anything, water-based, pigment strong, covering for, sunproof, waterproof. So I found this um, paint pen to be really, really good. So let me show you how this would work. So we're going to start with the back because I'm left-handed. So I need to do it backwards. And you have to be light. Doesn't have to be perfect, but it'll get there as you go along. Because what I find is you may end up having to do this a second time. And I kind of just go through and I light. I don't put much pressure because if you put too much pressure, the, it'll go outside of the lines, which you don't want. And I mean, I do occasionally find that it will happen, but it's okay because, you know, down the line, let's say you wanted to just sort of give this a refresher. You're not going to refresh the part that came out of the lines. So eventually that kind of disappears. But I found this pen to be really good because it's fairly narrow. so I can get into smaller spaces. And you just end up going along like this. And again, don't be too bothered if you make a mistake because it will wear off in time. And then if you decide you want to just give this a refresher, you can without too much trouble. So I'll just continue going along. And what you'll find is that it'll be easier to do if you do this slow and very little pressure on the pen top. Because if you put too much pressure, it will go outside the lines. And I mean, you can sort of see that maybe mine are slightly going out. Uh, I may have screwed up. Oh, no. I may have screwed up just a little on the T. See how it went a little farther out? But again, as you go along, you're going to find that there's certain parts you can end up fixing. The A's are always tricky because there's even a finer line down the center, but not too bad. 
and then let's do the S. Oh, might have got a little bit outside of the line. Oh, it's not too bad. I did get a little bit, but you can see there, there's some lettering and it's, it's not bad. It's, it's pretty good. There's a couple of missteps, but you can see, I find this gives the tire a whole new look. So I'm going to continue and finish both, both sides. Um, and then I'll show you the final, final, um, result. So there we go. There are both of these front tires done and I think they look great. And <clears throat> I just find that this pen is the, is the easiest thing to work with because obviously the pen tip stays wet. It, it's, it's always got paint on it. You need to shake it up a bit. Obviously you can hear the paint in there. But um, as a whole, I find this is the easiest way to give your tires that white letter look. So until next time, we'll see you in another video.